everyone, and welcome back to Incraft. I want to start off this episode with a little bit of self-promotion, which I don't usually do, but I feel like this time it's worth it because on Sunday I released a time-lapse video of a build that I made, and I think it's really cool, and I want all of you guys to see it because it's a cool project. Anyway, with that out of the way, it is time to continue along here in the quest book with Dwarves and Doguns Part 1. It's been highly uh, recommended in the comments, and I am very excited to start doing it. You have to investigate the theater at negative, or 1024, negative 5143. 1024, negative 5143. Okay, not that far away, which is good. Get on my horse, and let's go. Pretty much gotta go this way for a bit. Uh, 200 or so blocks, and then down a lot. Um, so I'll just follow this path, because that'll probably take me to where I need to go, though I can cheat a little and do that. Cool. <laughs> um, so, like, 1024 on the X. Um, okay. I guess we're going into here. This is Rotorock. This looks like a good place to go, you know, very fiery. Gotta love a good old fire every now and again. So it looks like we need to go this way, but uh, there's nothing there. So, I feel like there's a different way in here, maybe? This might be the way to go. I'm now entering Rotorock. All right, Rotorock. Uh, see a lot of lava. Not a lot of theaters, but there is a lot of lava, so that's helpful to find lava. Anyway, I'm now leaving Rotorock. Okay. <laughs> Am I now entering Rotorock? I'm now entering Rotorock. Alright. Uh, but this doesn't help me find the theater. I'm also way higher than I need to be. The upper Molten Heights. There appears to be a crystal of some kind. Um, well, okay. I, mean, I'm, I am actually pretty close on the coordinates. I just need to go down. Like a lot. It's also hard to see because of shaders. So, let's eliminate the problem. Okay, the problem has been eliminated, and now I can see. <laughs> and I can see that there's a hole in the ground, which, I don't know, maybe there's a theater in the hole. We just don't know these things, you know? Holes are great places to keep theaters, because they're very full of air. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh, okay, well, I am lower in the ground. I still need to go further down. Um, looking around. This looks like I might be able to go further down. No. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, it looks like we've reached a dead end here, which is unfortunate. Um, okay. Well, maybe there is another way out of this place. Or maybe there's more stuff here that I missed. What is this? Warning, do not enter. Okay. Guess we're not going in there. <laughs> Unless that's where the theater actually is. Hmm. Hmm. We just don't know these things. You know, maybe the theater is so exclusive that they put up warning signs to prevent the riffraff from getting in, you know? But I'm not the riffraff. I'm my own person. And I won't be rift or raft if I can help it. <laughs> anyway, I still have no idea where I'm supposed to be going here. Uh, but that's okay. Getting there is always possible as we saw with the previous quest. Always possible. And I can do whatever I need. So, um, 1024, negative 5143. So we need to go this way. We need to go this way. So, I'm gonna go back the way I came. Which is great for, you know, improving yourself. Going back to what you came from, great idea. Um, can I escape? Not, I can't escape in water. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, game. Really appreciate that one. Really uh, makes my life a lot easier. Anyway, this is a different staircase from the one I went up last time, I think. Um, okay, I need to go this way, though. So I'm going to jump down here anyway. Yoink. Beautiful. Okay, so negative 5, 1, 4, 3, and 10, 24. Okay, 10, 20, 4, negative 5, 1, 4, 3, 
Hang on. Almost there. Keep entering and leaving Rotor Rock. Alright, I made it. <laughs> We're here. I did it. Yay. Alright, now where's the theater? Oh wait, it's not here. I wonder why. Uh, okay. So I think... I'm not, I don't think I'm going to Upper Molten Heights. I think Rotor Rock is where I need to be. I just need to go deep into Rotor Rock. And I haven't been going deep. I've only been going up. I need to go down. Down into the ground. Yeah. Uh, but also, I don't know how to do that. So, is there something back here? Nope, just more lava. Okay, Rotorock does not seem like a very good place to live for anyone. <laughs> Even the lava. I mean, this lava is having a rough time too, you know. Can't pay his taxes. His mortgage is late, you know. Just a real sad time for the lava. But in any case, there's lava there too, you know. It's a rough time. Um, still looking for a way out. Or a way in, I guess is the better statement there. Um, okay. So, 1040... 543, negative 1024. By 543. It's gonna be just this way. Hmm. I'm confused. Uh, as is understandable. Ow, I'm on fire. Ow. Ow. This guy has an axe, but this guy has like a hammer, dude? What did this guy do? Why did this guy get an axe, but that guy get a hammer? We just don't know. Sir, steel forge golems. Alright, very nice. Clearly the only the highest of quality golems for the citizens of Rotorock. There are a lot of things names down here. So I'm gonna assume that I can go down. Like this. Which is what I'm doing right now. Um there are a lot of things down here. I may have made a mistake moving in this far without, you know, clearing it out first. But luckily bomb arrow exists. Uh okay. Is there a Pyriant? Pyriant's Soldiers, workers, etc. They also can take a bomb arrow, which is scary. Oh, but they also have earth defense. That makes sense. Um, is this underground? Oh, it is underground. Huh. Okay, I'm getting attacked. Well, kind of. So, is this Rotorock? <laughs> or is Rotorock over this way? I'm getting kind of confused here. Because we're just kind of in a giant hole. How did I miss this? I mean, it would make I mean, it's underground, but also, like, is this... I mean, this is the right direction to go to the theater. Okay, this is Rotorock, right here. Huh. Not expecting that one. <laughs> Got a Powder Master. Is there... Oh, Rotorock. Cool. I guess there is a Scroll Merchant, which helps me out. Ding. <laughs> Cool. Now I can go back to Rotorock without having to lose myself in the above air. Uh, okay. Is there a bank? Question two of this 500 question questionnaire. Is there a bank? Not where is the bank? Because honestly, it you know, it's debatable. Is there a bank? Uh, uh jeweler station, this guards trade market. Uh, there are emeralds here, so maybe this is the bank that they might have. Uh, yes, you're a liquid merchant. Cool, I'm gonna deposit some stuff real quick. Get rid of those. Actually, keep the red rock. Get rid of that one. Okay, that's all I need to do. We're good. Bank visit completed. Um, well, I need to find the theater, which is my, you know, objective for this whole time. So, 5143 and negative 1020 or 1024. I need to go back this way a bit. That's the wrong direction. I need to go this way a bit. <laughs> oh, this guy. He looks he looks important. Hello, Lozeg. I don't know. He's a he's a dwarf, right? I don't know what dwarf voices sound like. Interesting to see a human wanting to see a dwarf in play. Only play we're performing is the annual victory festival. The entry cost is one damn block. What if I just snuck in? Oh, I started the quest. Alright, cool. Um Stage it that way. Can I sneak in? Do I have to pay you? Whatever. Just take a seat and enjoy the sh Did he take one? Or not? Oh. Well, this is a small show. I'll take a seat, though. Oh, that's a lot of dialogue. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> Hello to the people of Gavel. Glad to see so many here. 
I hope you'll enjoy the play, and that it will be very educational too. I will be tonight's narrator. Oh, dang it, I can't get rid of that stuff. Oh well. Uh, 900 years ago. Dwarfy and Babby. Phew, I think we outran the villagers. I think we are safe here in the mountains. Oh look, shiny ores. This is like a gold mine. Except they're shiny ores, not gold. These minerals are very nice. Let us start digging. You can start digging. <laughs> How nice, they're digging. Suddenly fire. What is that? A demon? Well, clearly you answered your own question there, buddy. Can I see? I want to see. I am a dangerous monster, and I will not let you mine these diamonds. We are the Doguns, and we will kill you. They attacked the poor dwarves without reason. Guarararo, I will eat you all for my afternoon demon luncheon. Ha ha ha, the demons do powerful magic. We must protect ourselves. He's about to get blasted. Mwah, be gone, tiny dwarves. Ah, uh, I am dying, dying. Mwah, we will kill all of you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> The demons shattered our weapons. Well, that wasn't very nice. With their magic, we had no chance. I mean, you look pretty fine to me. We need to forge better weapons so we can fight back. Why do you need to fight back? Just don't mind their ore. Gaggly? Who's Gaggly? Okay, well, he has to get Good idea. <laughs> we will use our <laughs> intelligence to <laughs> slay the demons. A great war took place. Actually, that was the First World War. <laughs> you cannot beat us. We can summon dragons with our magic. Is that your dragon? <laughs> dragons are ugh, no match for ugh, us. Charge! Uh... <laughs> the battle raged on for 200 years. <laughs> Many lives were lost. But the superior might of... The dwarves overcame the demon Doguns. The dwarven race finally beat the demons. Yay! <laughs> Punch! We have won! <laughs> Hooray! And now we have established a great citadel, Rotorok! The dwarven intellect beat the sheer power of the demon's magic. Yay! We conquered the demon city. The demons now flee at the sight of us. Oh. Thank you all for watching. Yay. I hope you enjoyed the show and learned something new today. Yeah, I learned that you guys can't act. Boom. <laughs> we are continuing this celebration at the old demon city. Follow the red banners outside Rotorock to get there. Meet you all there. Anything? No? Oh. Ugh, that was awful. Don't believe anything you see here, human. History is written by the victors. Hey, I was just about to talk about that. So, <laughs> it, I can, I don't know how far back I can go. Okay, perfect. So, these nice minerals are very nice. Let us start digging. What is that, a demon? I will not let you mine these diamonds. We are the Doguns and we will kill you. Okay. So, based off that alone, it seems to me like the demons are just trying to protect their ore. And that these guys, like, um, they outran the villagers? Why do they need to outrun the villagers? Like, what were the villagers doing to them? Are they thieves? Were they trying to steal the ore? Like, all of these things. It's very confusing. And clearly the dwarves managed to win the war because of how bad they were painting the demons. Because the demons just seemed like they were trying to defend themselves. You know, based off that, they were just trying to defend themselves. So, we'll see after we go to continue the celebration. Are these the actors? Hello, actors. You guys are uh, very, very beardy. Congratulations. Anyway, <laughs> we need to go to the Dogon Festival by following the red banners outside Rotorock. All right. To the outside of Rotorock. This is a very large dwarven man. Oh, what is this? Signs? Monument of Valor. Oh. A lot of uh, things. Serve without questions. Always honorable. There are also brothers in my arms. Okay. Thanks, King Duran. How do I leave? <laughs> Here? No, this is a weapon shop. Uh. Okay. I mean, I thought it would just be through here, but there's a giant dwarf in the way, so I can't really do that. <laughs> or did I come in from over here? 
Oh, yeah, it was over here. Okay, cool. Maybe I should have exit somewhere clearly defined. You know, with a large sign that says exit or something similar.